It all starts with the thought of an idea, a question or an answer to a question, then off I go researching about it. With enough material, I start writing the script. After a week of that, I go off to recording, which is the quickest task. And then I edit, and edit, and edit. With that done, I add some final touches, make a thumbnail, add a description, end screen cards, and that's it. The thing is, there is a whole another process I go through before even starting anything. And for me to explain, we gotta go back a bit. You see, I started making videos two years ago because I saw a few gaming channels with really good gaming setups. And I thought to myself, hey, if they can do it, maybe I can too. The problem with this is, it's not fully true. Although dreaming about having a good gaming setup might have been the reason I created this channel, it's not why I continued. It's just that before I started making videos, I was a lost soul maybe. I was decent at everything, wasn't great at anything, and any particular thing never interested me enough to think about pursuing a career in that field. So I never really knew what direction I wanted to go. For the longest time, I told myself I should join the police services because that's what my mom wanted and making my mother happy was a major part of my motivation in life till I was 16. I had convinced myself that that's where my happiness lies but I knew somewhere it wasn't true. When I was 16 years old, as I've said a million times in other videos, I switched my school, left my ridiculous toxic school and joined a new amazing all happy school. What I hadn't told you guys was I didn't like this school a lot in the beginning as well. So for the first 5 months, I rarely went to it. And when I didn't go to my school, I stayed at my house and watched a lot of YouTube gaming videos as I couldn't game cause my computer wasn't strong enough and I didn't own any consoles. My major source of entertainment was YouTube gaming channels. That's what brought me to start my very own channel. When I started, YouTube was a breath of fresh air for me. Every day, the motivation for me was checking my growth and making shitty gaming videos. Slowly, I started making better and better content. Slowly, things fell into places and I finally found something that I genuinely loved and wanted to make a career out of it. But to make a career out of it, you have to upload. You have to upload a lot. And when you make videos that take a lot of time, that's when you get hit. That's when your channel starts to bleed. You might be just one video away from blowing up, but not being able to post it enough makes it impossible for you. But that's just not it. I can't probably post a good amount of videos in a month. But then you have a life outside of just this. You have your college, your studies, your job, your pets, your family. Family. Meet my mom. She's cool. She's really talented. Whatever I have known is pretty much all thanks to her. But she doesn't understand what YouTube is and what I can do in this field. Then we have my brother. He's pretty chill overall, I like him. And here's my dad. He's more concerned with my future. He's more focused on what I have to study and my degree and my college and my college expenses and my life in college. He's a dad after all, his mind is cluttered with such thoughts. So to make videos, I have to spend a lot of time on my PC editing writing or maybe just procrastinating, seeing me not really socializing and just doing this all day kinda concerns them, which a lot of time leads to an argument between us, which ends up in me being in not so good mood, one of the main reasons of me not being able to post enough. Every day just passes by so quick, every day I don't post a video, I feel like I'm trapped inside my own mind, I'm trying to work but this won't just work out, I'm trying this every day over and over and over and over again but I just can't get myself to post. It's not that I feel like I have burnt myself out. It's exactly opposite of it. It's like I haven't burnt myself enough. It's because of thinking this way is why I put so much effort, so much work, so much of myself into these videos that I create just working on them day and night. And when I try to post every week, I don't hate it. But I don't like it either. I don't look forward to it. I don't feel like this is what I want. I don't want to do anything. I like the idea of being slipped away into this abyss. I like this. I like not doing anything. It's so much more easy. But then not doing it always has been easy. And I didn't do this because it was easy. I did this because it calmed that voice inside of my head. That voice inside of my head that keeps me awake at night telling me that I'm not good enough. So to calm that voice, I work. I work the hardest I could ever have. I make the best video till date. And then I post it. And I'm calm. I relax. I'm happy that it's done. Only to realize it's not. I gotta do this again. 
not because I want to, but I have to. But I just made the best I could, and now to make the best I can, I have to beat my best again. It's a never ending cycle and every time I post a video I go through this over and over again. I know there is no finish line, I know this is never going to end, but I just don't know. I know this video is vague and I don't expect you to understand what I just said, because honestly I don't either. I just wanted to let you know what goes through my mind when I don't post and as always I don't have a good outro yet.